Alright guys, I want you to know that this is the fourth time running through this area because my recording software is dumb. I've switched to the long... The, I've switched this item, my main item, to the Lothric Knight Sword, which I I sharpened up. Uh, it has the ba it has the same quality, same attack as the katana, roughly. A little bit better, but he's also a faster swinger, and since these things are too too weak to survive uh, multiple hits, the bleed doesn't really affect. Uh, I'm not gonna get these things to bleed if they're already dead. So by swinging fast, I can just kind of go and take them out. I'm a little bummed because while I was at this area, a cool thing happened. I met an old an old friend from Dark Souls. I met Sigmire. Who a picture will be posted up here. He is in Dark Souls 3. Yay! But now in order for me for me to get recording on him, I have to go through all my, my thief character and you know have you guys meet him all over again. Yay! It's not bad, my thief character is fairly close in level in level, but I generally just kind of play to goof off and find new things. Alright, so secrets. See this area? There's stuff. See that archer? He's a dick. Reason why I'm going spoof is because I can run by all of these guys, climb up this ladder, get attacked, roll away, jump to this side, Realize that Spook disappeared already. Run past him. Get Spook. Chop this guy. Jump down after him because I don't take damage with as long as I have Spook. And here I am. That's what you guys missed. There's a couple items up there. Don't forget them. This body drops the, the flame stone slow, stone split. Stone plate ring increases fire absorption. You guys are caught up now. Inside this building, this is the tower where that knight was shooting at us with those giant arrows slash giant douchebag things. Oh. Okay. Hmm. I met him again. He's back. Where were you? Where'd you go? I need to go down. Hmm. Okay, 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 okay. First, let me get my souls. Wait for him, wait for this thing to come up. Go down, because so what happened is it was going up the first time, and then I and then I clicked on it and I went and came down. Cool. But down here is an enemy. I've died to him twice. It's because he's fast, and I don't know if I can absorb dodge his attacks. Or, or, sorry, absorb his attacks. Good, always getting item. Ooh, bonfire. There are so many bonfires in this area. I 
Actually, it looks like I've gone past this bonfire area. Or, past the area that I need to go. I'm gonna go back. One, I don't want to have to fight this guy again. Two, I want to go find Siegmeier. The Ithriel Straight Sword. Uh, it needs a little bit more strength for me to wield. Um, let's see. Straight Sword bestowed upon the Outrider Knights. Of the Boral Valley. This weapon is enshrouded in frost and cross causes frostbite. Not bad. Every Outsider Knight one day devolves into a beast, constantly hounded by Pontiff Sh Sullivan's black eyes. Okay. So this weapon actually explains what that giant giant frost cat was last time. He was he was a knight. From this area. And he turned into a giant beast. He was probably a general. He was probably, you know, he was probably something higher than a, than what this guy was. So go up here, come back here. Get ready to use my my uh my spook so I can jump down and not die. Oh man, where are you? Mm -hmm. Oh, there you are. Mm -hmm. Ah, oh, don't disappear like that. You had me downright worried. Be mean I disappeared. Thanks to you, an epiphany has struck me square in the head. I've unraveled the riddle of this inscrutable lift. <laughs> you mean you step on it, jump off, and, and step on the way going up? Some days I begin to doubt myself. I went up the tower, so I thought, then somehow ended up here. I'm not exactly sure what happened. Anyhow, do you see that? That humongous beast? I'm no coward and I have a steady hand, but that thing makes my skin crawl. Oh, shit. How now? Think twice before you go down that road. I could try talking some... S no, I think not. I've got to you. Hmm. Yeah, no, he's on fire. He's big, he's got a tail, he's got an axe, and he's on fire. No, I shouldn't have. I'll be fine. It's too late now. I seek word of the Knights of Katarina. Fight by your side. No, protect the Siegfried. Get out of the corner. No, 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 you're not gonna kill him. You're not going to kill my chubby little buddy. Shit. Where's this attack coming from? Oh, he's gone. Whoo, okay. Don't. Do that! I am awesome. You two are awesome. 
but I want you to live. You're a cool dude. If I die, I disappear. I come back. The people watching me get to hopefully enjoy my commentary for a little bit longer. That was quite a performance. But you mustn't get in over your head. We unkindled must put our duties first. Oh, you're not kidding. But okay. For the moment, we've a toast to make. To your valor, my sword, and our victory together. Hell to the air, man. Long may the sun shine. <laughs> you. Oh, man. Okay. I shall. Let's see. I don't need this one. I replace you with toast. There we go. I don't know if this does anything for you and your quest line. Well, I'm going to have myself a little nap. <laughs> the only thing to do, really, after a nice toast. <laughs> okay, he's he's asleep. <laughs> oh man. Oh, uh, I didn't one. I didn't expect to get into a fight that fast. Two, Sigmire, man. Why? Why did you? Uh, this guy, this guy, even in past games, he was always cool. He was, he was right behind you on your quest to to stop, um, to light the bonfires, to light the kindles, and he was always there. He didn't get a chance to shine though. He got one chance to fight, and this time, this this time, this guy just joined you straight into battle. Uh, I love this character. He is awesome. Now, what did I get? Restores HP and boost frost resistance. Um, I will use a humanity, or sorry, a, a kindling flame. Ah, okay. Explore around here. And see if there's anything good from this giant dead fire corpse. Oi, oi, oi. I did not expect to get into a fight that fast. Well, either way, it all worked out in the end. Northerner armor. Uh, frost resistance and uh, an armor protection. Oh shit, these guys. Red... Bug pellet? Ah, red bug pellet. Temporary boost fire damage absorption. Very nice. Oh, I'm so glad I actually... I didn't think about it, but I'm so glad I put on that that fire ring. That probably saved my life. Oh wait. Shank you. Shank you. So many dead corpses stuck together into a. Come on, man! You're multicolored. Of course you're going to try and drop down on me. You actually are completely different colored compared to everything else. That would have been dangerous. But doesn't matter. I wish they I wish it wasn't so easy to tell that I was going to be in ambush. It's just a slight discoloration. Oh, shh. 
But that it's just a slight discoloration, but that slight discoloration gave me the no the the no uh forethought to give it give it a stab with my shank. Sorry. With my S duck, who I called it. Like he's not one. Hey, he's not one. He could have been one. No, 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 yes. Three. It's, uh, it's... It's just not... It's just not cool when I can... When I can kind of easily notice it. I'll take this as three souls, that's fine. Alright, see this chest? How it has a circle? That means it's not a mimic. Oh, I missed one. Thank god, I missed one. It was an ambush. Oh no. Human pine resin. Hmm. Uh, applies dark to right hand weapon. All right. Very much like fire and lightning, it is a type of element that can be used to empower your weapon. Same way I use my magical weapon, is the same way for. Same way I use my magical weapon is the same way that this is useful. Come on. Oh shit. Dark hex spells. I need to pull one of you down and kill you there. That's close enough. Avoid the curse, avoid the curse. Thank you for joining me down here. Ooh, shit. Ah ha ha, damn it. I lost all my S's. I'm gonna do a jump cut and find my way back here.
Cool. Well, I'm back. I basically just uh, ran through all of it. Because... This place is a dick. Okay, so since I'm killing these guys who are now fairly easy, one, these are, these are like three to eight guys stuck in a room, and that is awesome. As long as I can get one of you down, I don't care. I don't know why I never thought of doing this. Maybe because it's slow, slow and boring. But I don't care about fighting these guys. I might like their stuff, but I want to know what they were looking at. I want to know what they're looking at more than I want to prove to you guys that I don't suck at video games. That's a lie. I do want you to know that I suck at video games. Twisty labyrinth, twisty labyrinth of rooftops. What the hell? All of this is just here. There's so much of just random stuff. I like it. Is it all of this for for that? Maybe. Ooh. Ring of Flynn. The eulogized thief. Lowering equip load increases attack power. Flynn fought with the wind at his side and was a hero among the weak and poor, yet even his admirers knew that it was little more than an I idyllic fable. Alright guys, I'm going to change up my equipment load because I want to be awesome. Cutting it about cutting it down to about half would probably be good. Hey guys, you remember me? I don't know. I don't know exactly how low you have to go to fit it. 
but I want to see if my uh, eventually I'm gonna test on one of the weaker NPCs down there to see if it actually if it's actually useful. But I'm I'm just hoping that I don't have to like run around completely naked on this. No, all right. So I guess that's all around here. That's all there is to this area, except for you know the giant boss and the thing and those big guys and those douchebags. So where do you lead out? You don't lead out anywhere. Well, guys, I'm lost. I'm lost and trapped in a strange and wondrous small fire fireplace. Cool, whatever. I'm gonna homeward bone, cuz I'm gonna head up, I'm gonna go kill something, and hopefully I can go wander around safely without without getting shot by a giant fucking arrows. Hey. Oh, I can talk to you. I help any time. I help any So now I feel kind of bad for just kind of running up and hitting you. My bad. Shit, all I had to do is just wander over here and just ask you nicely. This is a Dark Souls game. This is unheard of. Alright. Well, that's what's at the top of the tower. Yay, top of the tower. So, a cool little interaction. Uh, if you remember here from last time, I'm not being shot at. Instead, the giant aims at the other, aims at the undead workers. Meaning, I can safely go up here and not worry about being shot in the face. And up here, there are an item. Mortician's ass. What is it though? Ah, here we go. Shrine handmade will prepare new item. Okay, so at the Fireling Shrine, this the old lady will, you know, uh, will apparently use it. I don't know. I'll, we'll see what that what happens there. Oh shit! You sneaky little bastard. Uh, okay, let's see what I picked up. The cleric set. The blue cleric robe. Cleric gloves and the cleric trousers. Not bad. Oh wait, did I pick up an item? No, I didn't pick up an item. You will hit him for me. 
Fire my giant, fire! You missed. You missed. There you go. Thank you. Double, thank you. Oh shit. Sometimes it's it's difficult to get out of the mindset that he's not trying to hit you, but I believe he still can, if that makes sense. I don't know if friendly, fly, friendly fire is on with him, but he does he does try and shoot things. La, da, 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 da. It's a field of flowers. Nothing can ever go wrong. Let's see. Beautiful tree. Beautiful vines. Flowers. Yeah. The only thing that's weird and ugly is this thing that looks like skulls and crossbones. Are you ugly? No, man, I love you. I love dreams. They allow me to breathe. Put stomp, giant ain't okay, oh, we. Alright, this can be great. Oh, wait, nope. Got it. Put don't do shit. Uh, do I have to hit him in the nuts? I do, I have to hit him in the nuts. Alright. Get rid of these random ads, because these things will kill me. What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, more of these things are just going to keep appearing. All right, so I can't. I really cannot take my time. All right, keep through the nuts. I saw your hand come up. And this thing is so weird. Is he digging people up? Oh, shit! What is this? What is this? What is that ooze? Oh shit. Okay. Now what do I hit you? Oh fuck! Okay. Good, I think. You were ugly and you suck. 
I mean, you are very lovely. And where do I hit you? Oh, in the back. I can, in the back is I can attack in the back. Alright, I gotta find out what this hand is gonna be doing. This is a grabby hand. Yep, grabby hand. I need fire. He's a tree, so I need fire. Oh, shit. Shortcuts are fun, if you remember to use them. I opened up so many shortcuts around here, I still get lost. Oh, you slow me down. 
Ja. pieces of you. No, not that hand. Tiny hand. Gotta destroy the tiny hand. Got it. Okay, there's a thing on the back of your leg. There's a thing in the middle of the front. of the rotten great wood transposing kill kill transposing kills make souls transportation possible transposition an old transposing kiln from uh, curlin crafted with stitched crystal lizard hide given to luthith lord of cinder to conduct soul transportation this kiln can transpose twisted souls to craft special items with their concentrated essence deemed forbidden by those unable to make proper use of it Awesome. And I also got Soul of the Cursed Rotten Greatwood. One of the twisted souls steeped in strength, used to acquire many souls or transposed to extract its true strength. Ever since its establishment, all manner of curses have managed to seep into the undead settlement. The worst of them were sealed away inside a spirit tree, but eventually the curses took their toll. So he seems in he seems intimidating. You don't do a lot of damage, however you get once you figure out that there is a lot, once I figured out that there was a lot of um, little bobbles that I could hit, he was fine. Like I didn't have to worry um, about that. All I had to do is find find an opening, and he kind of killed himself. Uh, in comparison, the the previous bosses, is, especially to me, the boards of the of the valley, he was much harder. Gracious, passing fine ash thou hast given. Let this ash be stone nourish. I only hope these knew where. <laughs> okay, let's see what else you have. You have more embers. You have alluring skulls and human pine resins. That's new. Charcoal pine resins. I always those are always fun. I will buy this grave key. Uh, heal aid. Don't really care for it. Um. Guy, this guy. Make yourself useful, King. Belike it is a transposing kiln in thy possession. See now. Bring to transposition is the art in transposing a twisted soul. Thy purpose is to seek lords.
Okay, so I have two items. I have two items that I can... I can... Uh, sorry, two souls that I can make. Um, let's see what we have here. We have... Okay. Using the soul of the Rotten Greatwood, the giant tree that I just killed, I can turn into a hollow greatsword. Dexterity build? Don't really care. Um, here you go. The soul of a demon. The great axe. Also a strength character. Soul of the Boreal Valley, uh, Valley Vort. You know, his hammer that he was using. But, again, I... Dexterity. There's not really much... Uh, I could use this. Riding Greatwood, one of the cursed... Um, uh, shield Splitter, yeah. I might use it, but whatever. I... <laughs> Neat. They, okay, so this is a fist. A demonic fist that burns with fiery essence. Its wielder can release its power through use of its skill. Flame Whirlwind. Ooh. Okay, I'm gonna go... I'm gonna build... I'm gonna build a strength character just to use these fist weapons. And this uh, Pontiff's left, left eye. Um, using the soul of the uh, Boreal Valley Vort. Uh, considering I can only use between those two. Bewitching greed that Pontiff Sol Sullivan bestowed upon his knights. Recovered HP with successive attacks. Knights who peer into the back black orb are lured and battled to death. Transformed into frenzied beasts. No wonder the Pontiffs only provide these rings to those dispatched to foreign lands. Um, yes. And... I will build this. And then I have... Now, now. Yeah. Cool, then I can just level up. Of... Man, what? I don't know. He's just gonna then keep giving me levels? Is there... Of... Is there like a break? Is there like a limit? Am I gonna die? This but a dream. Then shall we begin, Baron? Thank you, mysterious man, who has given me a power that can in no way hurt me or harm me. Magic of, but I can teach. Perhaps I believe we build. Darkseid is weird, man. Not bad. Not bad. I have so many weapons that just pierce through damp pierce through. <sighs> okay. Ooh, okay, he does have something cool. Defeated foes restore HP. Uh alright. Well I mean if I'm gonna use anything as a spear, I may as well use that, but I'm not. At least not right now. I've been here long enough. Thank you for joining me. This has been Chris. Thanks for watching Dark Souls, and if you like any of this stuff, you know, let me know. Pop a like, give me a subscribe. Pop a comment. Anything is interesting. I want to know people are watching this and that people are enjoying it. Anyways, see you later. Bye.